the electoral race, it might give you a clue. Broughty Ferry Beach on a brisk knee, freezing January afternoon. Could it be that one of the nominees for the rectorship of Dundee University will soon be donning the minimalist garb of a lifeguard to charge into the hardly beckoning waters of the Tay? Students may now be considering this question as they ponder the list of nominees submitted for their rectorial race. Dr. Abdel Fattah El Awasi, an Islamic academic, and NSP Nick Johnston may not be household names, but comedian and Dundee University graduate Fred McCauley is getting that way, and so too is Countdown presenter Richard Whiteley on Channel 4. Well, what I think I can bring to a uh, fine university uh, such as uh, Dundee is uh, obviously a commitment from me to uh, do my best for it. That's uh, all I can offer, really, as far as I can do my best. But beating them all in terms of international public profile is this man, David Hasselhoff, star of Baywatch and friend of Pamela Anderson. Like the others, Hasselhoff has been nominated by 50 students and his form has been signed David Hasselhoff. But could it be a hoax? All the nominations are, are to be confirmed over the next couple of days, but on the assumption that it's a, a genuine nomination, we, you know, we have a, a signed acceptance form, then um, yeah, excellent. Uh, high profile, if you can attend uh, the, the meetings that you'd be required to attend, then we would be delighted to have any of them. A further nomination, Twinkle Rat, was ruled invalid on the grounds that the nominee did not personally sign the form, confirming acceptance of the nomination. There was no evidence that paw prints found on the form belonged to the candidate and were not obtained under duress. So will the Hasselhoff nomination meet the same fate? University authorities won't know for sure until tomorrow. But assuming it's genuine, the choices in our less than scientific poll indicated he might not get the job anyway. Fred and Corley. David Hasselhoff. Fred and Corley. And rumours in the students' union that Hasselhoff-induced Hawaiian or Californian fever had come to the fore were said to be greatly exaggerated. Uh, Five two minutes countdown time, literally in the race for the rectorship of Dundee University. Richard Whiteley, host of the Channel 4 Word Game Countdown, will be doing his bit to win the prestigious post at the traditional students' hustings tonight by video. Who will be the rector of Dundee University after the largely absentee reign of comedian Tony Slattery? Despite his nomination, it won't be the star of Baywatch, David Hasselhoff, who withdrew because of his filming commitments. But it could be this man, Richard Whiteley, the avuncular host of television's Countdown. Tonight, in the raucous settings of the traditional student hecklings, Richard Whiteley will be pitting his wits against comedian Fred McCauley, Arab specialist Abdel Fatah El Awasi, and Nick Johnson, MSP. Except, Mr Whiteley will be doing it in a somewhat detached manner. He'll be making his pitch by pre-recorded video from the Countdown Studio, flanked by the University Crest. Now look, I'm really sorry I can't be with you in the flesh. Uh, mind you, it might scupper entirely my chances if you actually did see me in the flesh. The fact is, I'm in America right now, and this whole election thing has happened so quickly that I just couldn't change my plans, so I'm really sorry. As far as we're aware, it's the first time ever that uh, this kind of uh, process has been done by video, so it's quite exciting there. Obviously, if he wins the election, he is going to have to turn up on campus. You, you can't serve your office um, by video, but um, it's, it's a fun video. It's quite exciting, and uh, we're, we're happy enough to, uh, to do things this way. Some of the people who'll be voting got a sneak preview today. Anyway, hecklings it is, so let's get heckling. I'll just pause for a minute while you have a good heckle. <laughs> So what do the students think? Fantastic. Something. Excellent. Brilliant. Mr. Whiteley promises to take the job seriously and will move heaven and earth to bring Carol Vorderman to graduation day. And in a report to David Hasselhoff, he says he and Carol will be starring in a brawl and babe TV epic filmed in the north of England called Whitley anyway, Baywatch. Uh, well, I'd give my vote to Carol Vorderman if she was standing. Preferably in a red building suit, I bet. Definitely better than his ties, aren't they? Thank goodness he's in America. Indeed. That brings us to the end of tonight's programme.